What's going on guys? Today we are jumping into a new video showcasing a product that we have here at EliteFTS.com, our Easy Spotter Straps. These are a great tool for anybody with a garage gym, anybody that utilizes a barbell, or anybody that wants to lift safely. So at first glance you may be, may be thinking, oh this is just a product video, blah, 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 blah. but no. We're going to be jumping into things that you can use these spotter straps for to make your training get to the next level, as well as really cool ways to maximize your investment using these straps. So, easy spotter straps, as they kind of sound in their title, they're very easy to set up and they use are used to spot a barbell, right? You've probably seen these on monoliths, you've seen these in other places. You may be thinking, why would I buy these when I have safety pins or I have safeties on my rack? These are really, really easy to maneuver really, really lightweight, and they are absolutely bulletproof and will not break on you. These things are absolutely amazing. And again, like I said, if you're a garage gym owner and you have to mess with the pins and the straps and the this and the that, it can be kind of a pain in the butt. So yes, they are fantastic for spotting. Yes, they are fantastic for doing the job they are designed for, but what else can you use them for, right? This seems like a, an expensive investment if you do not have more than one use for it. These can be used for a multitude of different reasons. First and foremost, suspension training. What do I mean by that? Have you ever done an Anderson squat? Have you ever done a suspended good morning? You need some sort of strap to hold that in place, right? You can do them off of pin safeties, but what you're gonna find is that in, a, in order to be able to get into a really good position, you need to be kinda able to wiggle the bar around to make sure that you can fit under the bar. If you're doing these off of pins, they get to be kind of a pain in the butt. So not only are they good for suspension training, they're good for saving your life if you drop the bar, they're also really, really good for doing things that you can do with jammer arms. So if you've been watching the video up to this point, thank you for sticking around. This is like a little secret tip. You've seen big, heavy jammer arms that sit on racks, right? They're massive. We actually have a pair here at Elite FTS but they're huge, they get in the way, and they're heavy, right? It's a pain in the butt to adjust them. With these, with this system that we have here, you can do jammer arm activities or jammer arm exercises without having to have jammer arms. The coolest thing is, if you get sick of these things dangling here, you can just pull them up and out of the way. Much better when it comes to uh, having something in a smaller garage gym, or even if you have your own private studio or whatever it is that you, you, you train your clients or you, you, you have uh, for your facility. These are a great tool because again, you get to do jammer-like activities, right? Look at how athletic I am, boom. You can again, build that upper body power. You can turn this into almost like a split jerk too, right? You can be in this position here, up, catch. Like I said, pure athleticism. It's a great way to get that same sort of stimulus without having to buy the big bulky arms that you'll use for like two weeks and then they'll just collect dust in your corner. The last thing I wanna show with these, what we'll do, pop these off the bar because they are so easy to do so. If you have a pair of these on your rack, we all know how expensive suspension trainers are. You know, the ones with the handles that are yellow and black. Look at this. Now you have your own suspension trainer that you can do everything that you would normally with a certain yellow and black handled suspension trainer, right? You can do your lateral, you can stretch, you can do your lateral squats. You can do it the other way and do your fallouts, right? It's kind of cool, right? Having one piece of equipment that you can do so many different things on. And again, if your rack isn't this tall, because this is probably the tallest rack I've ever seen, you can bring these down even further. You can loop your foot in there. You can do single leg work. You can do single arm work, whatever you want to do. So guys, at first glance, these are not just, well, these look like just spotter straps, but realistically they are a multitude of different types of equipment and a ton of different exercises that you can use in your training in a garage gym, in a small gym, 
or if you wanna get a lot of bang for your buck when you're buying equipment. So what we'll do is we'll put the link down below if you wanna check these out. I know me personally, if I still had my garage gym, I would get a pair of these to make spotting easier because I was working out alone, but also it would have saved me some money not having to buy other things as well. So guys, if you enjoyed this video, make sure you share, like, subscribe, do all the things. On behalf of myself and Jacob behind the camera, we hope you enjoy and we will see you in the next one.